Hey, it's Barbara Michelle, and for this video, I'll be scrapbooking a, pa a picture of my dog, Wilma. And this picture was taken while she was lying on a towel on the riverbank on her first camping trip. It was about, well, Memorial Day weekend of 2015. So I have these papers from my Citrus Twist Kit, and I love that pink brush studio paper with the birds and the trees. And I thought it would go great with the, the nature of this photo. I wanted to keep as much of that paper visible as possible. So right now I'm just um, matting my photo on some other one other pages from my Citrus Twist Kit. One was um, Maggie Holmes Bloom and then uh, Crepe Paper. The pink one I think was also Maggie Holmes Bloom. It was just a, that pink one, um, it's just a piece I had left over, but I had cut part of the strip. And the green one, I'm not as sure. It's kind of kind of got a aqua green grid to it. I'm not sure what that paper's from, but anyways, I re I matted the photo, and now I'm just going to work on placing some embellishments around the photo. These are wood veneer butterflies. I believe they're from Studio Calico. And later, I will use some Dilutions um, ink spray to put some color on them. But right now, I'm just seeing which ones go. Where they would go best on the layout. And these little are little cork pieces. One's a little heart, uh, the other one says love, and one's just like an X or plus sign. And then I have some pieces from a cut apart sheet. Uh, they say the one at the top says happiness found, and then the blue and pink one uh, above the photo says good things. And the little yellow one said enjoying every moment. So these little letter stickers that I used for my title, which is Lucky Dog, also came from my Citrus Twist Kit, but they didn't have a manufacturer's name, so I don't know um, who makes them. But they're kind of like a orangey color, kind of a peachy orange color, and they're a little bit transparent. You could kind of see the design of the paper behind them. Um, now I'm just adding some ink spray, some Dilutions ink spray to the page because we were at the river uh, when the picture was taken. So I just wanted to add this blue to represent the water. Wilma did not enjoy the river. It was still kind of chilly. The water was pretty cold and uh, she would hardly get in it. So she really, she just enjoyed sitting on the riverbank watching everybody uh, play. I tried to take her in a couple of times, but she was having none of it. That's okay. Maybe next time. I think she enjoyed camping. Um, for the most part, she did really well in the we tent camp. So she did really well sleeping in the tent. The noises didn't bother her too much. But she did get um, a few bug bites from being on outside on the ground so often. So I don't really know if we're going to take her camping. Or maybe we'll do something different. I don't know if we'll take her again, because I didn't like that she, her her ankles were all kind of, um, I don't know, she had like little bumps on her ankles. And I, I took her to the vet and they gave her some medicine when we got back home. So she's, she's all fine now. So now I'm just um, adding the ink spray to those wood veneer pieces. Uh, it's Dilutions ink spray. I'm not exact. I think the one, the yellow color was sunshine. And probably the other one was um, Funky Fuchsia, maybe? I really like those two colors together. They make the the butterflies kind of orangey, but I really like it anyway. So now I'm just inking up the edges of that little tag at the top, or the flag, the happiness found, and I'm going to attach it with my tiny attacher. And I'm going to add... No, and I did add a little glassine bag behind the photo where I'm going to later die cut a, a tag and stick it in there, and I'll put my journaling on the tag that's in the that's in the bag. I'm just gluing down the butterflies and the cork pieces, um, and I'm going to put down my title later. After the video is over, I do outline the title in a black marker so that it shows up a little bit better. But for right now, I just left it as is. So these are just some puffy stickers that came in my 
kit, again the Citrus Twist kit, and I'm using some yellow stars. There's a couple of yellow, yellow accents on the birds that are around the page. I tried to stick with the colors that were that were already on the page when I was doing the layout. And these are some enamel dots and I just put one in the center of each of the butterfly. And there's the tag. I did die cut it from just using my cuddle bug. Uh, I don't even know what paper I used to die cut it from. But I'm just adding the little baker's twine to the top. And one more little piece from the cut apart sheet. That one says lucky me. That little blue uh, piece of paper there. Oh, this is a stamp that came with the Citrus Twist Kit. It said, you had me at hello. That really refers to Wilma. We fell in love with her, you know, as soon as we picked her up. Uh, I was just adding a little bit of border strips to the layout. They are from um, that Maggie Holmes, or yeah, a Maggie Holmes Bloom paper that I matted the photo on. So I just cut two strips for the top and bottom. I did remove that flat or that tag at the top, but I'll put it back. I took the I took the first staple out, and I'm just going to staple it back in the same spot it was before. And I'll trim it down. And I'm almost at the end of my layout. I'm just inking up the edges, and I'll have some close-ups in just a moment. So thank you so much for watching. Please like and subscribe below. Have a great day.